A physics professor at the University of San Diego is pioneering a new community mentorship program to build more confidence in women and minority students interested in STEM. In this Innovate 8 report, our Abby Alford shows us the program aimed at opening minds about a career in physics and opening doors to let underrepresented groups in. It may feel warm inside the quantum hydrodynamics lab, but it is the coolest place on USD's campus to empower women and underrepresented communities. So the table is pretty warm to the touch. Meet University of San Diego physics professor, Dr. Marin Mossman. And I'm very passionate about cold atoms. She loves geeking out on science. The quantum is the science of the very small. And she'll talk your ear off about the coldest matter in the universe. Well, I'm very passionate about what I do. Um, and I think my students know that. So. <laughs> the model underneath this aluminum is baking at 350 degrees Celsius, similar to the work Mossman is collaborating with on the International Space Station. We're looking at the fundamental nature of physics. But a bigger project is paving the way for women and minority physics students. But I am a female in physics and there aren't a lot of us. In fact, the American Institute of Physics found only 19% of academic physics faculty are women. And it's been shown one of the reasons why women and underrepresented minorities don't stay in physics, they're not retained within physics, is because they don't have this sense of identity. And so Dr. Mossman built a different kind of model called the Claire Booth Loose Physics Identity Program, or PIP. To help them realize that they do belong in physics, no matter if they're a woman, if they're an underrepresented minority, if they're a male in physics, like these things are available to everyone. One of her students, Lee Lennon, says physics should no longer be a boys club. I think definitely more and more it's it's getting a lot easier to, to work with people. But uh, occasionally you'll get that one standout person that's like, ah, could you not? I work here, like, I, I know how to use this. Don't do that. She, Danielle Smith, and Judith gonzalez Oribes will join the physics identity program next year. Learn more about, like, how, like, the world, like, works. Danielle says that Mossman has already made her feel like she belongs. It's super easy to talk to. Yeah. Like, I don't feel any judgment whenever I ask any questions. Their program isn't just about science, but professional development, speaker series, and social events like coffee hour. And I want other people to see that you can also be passionate about something and still have things like a family. You can still have things like, you know, a regular life as well as being a scientist. And being a woman or minority who belongs in STEM. To learn more about the USD Physics Identity Program, go to cbs8.com, click on the Help button.